Hello everyone and welcome. Welcome to our last Friday in the year 2016. Our last Friday. It's not as gloomy as it appears, right? It'll be another Friday. Onward with new challenges. Onward with new predictions. Right? Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we are here for three ESP cards. Our final ESP cards for the year 2016. All right, ladies and gentlemen, on these cards we have symbols. We have five symbols. We have a star, we have a square, we have a waving line, we have a plus sign, and we have a circle. And the object is to close your eyes. It's not, you know, you know, requirement to close your eyes, but, you know, you might want to close your eyes. Use that third eye in the center there to guess what the symbol is. Is it a star? Is it a square? Is it a wavy line? Is it a plus sign? Is it the circle? This is card number one. You do not need to have your vision with your own two eyes. So, think about it. Feel it. It's a red card on the one side and the symbol is on the other side. Yeah. There you go. That's card number one. Back into the deck it goes, back into the deck, and we shuffle, and we don't know what will be next. But, you know, the symbol could come up again, so, ladies and gentlemen, yeah, I look down at them, but I'm not seeing the symbols. So, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, here's your card number two. Is it the star? Is it the square? Is it the wavy line? Is it the plus sign? Is it the circle? Card number two. Too far away, you can't see it. Well, let me bring it closer to you. Remember, the outside is red. This is the reason why I'm giving the colors today for certain visitors. So, here we go. Card number two is up. What is the symbol? Is it a star? Is it a square? Is it a wavy line? Is it a plus sign? Is it the circle? Got it? Alrighty. Yeah. Do you feel that red? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, our final ESP card for the year 2016, all right? Here you go. Card number three is up. Is it a star? Is it a square? Is it a waving line? Is it the plus sign? Is it the circle? Got it? There you go. Can you hear it? Can you feel the red? Can you hear the red? All right, ladies and gentlemen. That is it. That is card number three. All right. That is our final ESP card. Most likely, unless maybe I'll do a live event here on uh, the weekend. But we do have other videos getting ready to come out. And we got a lot of work to do there. So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to see the results of the ESP cards right about there. Towards the end of the video. All right. Good magical morning everybody and welcome to the Friday morning reading. A little bit of tarot and spiritual strangeness for you to start your day and again welcome. I'm Charles. I am your host with the ghost but yeah she's not here at the moment. She this female entity that uh, frequents our company just about every day. But uh, the alien, he's over here. He's right there. But you can't really see him. He's set up for the New Year's, all right? So, yes, it is the final morning rush of the year 2016. And I thank everybody who's joined me this year. It's been a pretty darn good ride, all right? We've uh, educated a lot of folks. We've, uh, we've, uh, I don't want to say turn them on to some new things this year. You know, you all, you, you all open for new things. You're open to the unexplained. You're open to things that you can't see with your own two, two eyes. So, you know, that's why you're here. You're special, right? You are special in your own way. It takes all of us to make our world go round. But. Well, you say we get on with a little bit of a tarot and spiritual strangeness to close out our morning rush for this year. 
Seems weird, huh? But uh, anyway, yeah, let's do it. Um, get to the ESP symbols towards the end of the video, like I said, and shuffling is done. So let's get on. I remember I split it to the left and then I spread it to the right. Yeah. So, yeah, we, there we go. I got two on that last one, but it's not bad enough to be a miss deal. So, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Um, it looks like we have a continuation of a couple things we've seen the past two days. Uh, some of you might be heading back to that court date. Uh, maybe it was postponed, but it's still looking like it's pretty good. Actually, today looks better than it was the other day. Or if this is a separate incident, incident, inst, instance, if this is a separate instance, well, it looks like uh, the courts, the law, will be in your favor today. Actually, a little bit more than uh, they would have been yesterday or the day before. I think it was yesterday that we saw it, too. All right, and... Uh, it looks like today that maybe, you know, if you haven't found out what that person in your past uh, was not uh, telling you, you know, information kept from you, well, it looks like today is a good day that you might be finding these things out. Okay, um, and uh, some of you will be, I'm getting that you're going to be uh, working longer than others today, but that looks like it's good. It's a good choice. You know, you, uh, you chose wisely because... Uh, this, um, I don't, don't want to say you're gracious, but I guess you are, uh, to let the others leave a little earlier, and you're holding the fort, as they say, and, uh, well, it's gonna, it's gonna look good for you for doing this. Uh, looks like the night is gonna get even better for you, because I see the temperature, I see the, the warmth of your body getting warmer as the day goes on, as the sun sets in your area. Hmm. Boy, well, it sounds like uh, you need a different type of reading here. Besides our daily rush, remember, readings are for your entertainment purposes only. I guess that was pretty entertaining. But um, remember, not everything I say will pertain to each and every one of you. So, you take the information or you don't, okay? Alrighty. And, let's see, let's continue on. Let's get past the love. Hmm. Well, the love will be there even after the reading is done. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, it looks like today's a good day for you to go and tackle something that you've been putting off for a little while. I mean a little while, you know, a few days, week, whatever. Um, but it looks like you, you should be getting this done today. And uh, that's going to be good for you because this will be one burden off your shoulders. All right, you know, uh, let's not take some unfinished business into next year, if possible. But uh, I also get... You know, as I said that, I said that because I also get there will be some unfinished business for some of you, especially if you're in the office type of work or office environment. Um, but uh, it looks like this unfinished business going into the next year could be just new business from same clients. So, that looks cool. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. We got it. So, uh... I picked up the spread. We'll do another little spread here. And remember, I am available to go private. If you need a reading, just get in touch with me at that uh, email. I will be around all this holiday weekend. So don't be nervous about contacting me because I will be there. All right. Uh, if it's like the Christmas weekend, I got a little busier on the Monday following the holiday New Year's is on what Sunday I think so if anything is going on it'll most likely be Monday so I will be available for your private entertainment uh, activities All right so remember mystic dot Charles on Skype if you need an email questions done we'll just get in touch with me and we'll make that arrangement so anyway ladies and gentlemen I laid down another set I split it to the left and laid it to the right uh, looks like today's a good day that you're gonna be finding out about how to make uh, some more money 
I see your riches increasing by a learning activity, all right? Uh, now, I'm not getting this learning activity in school. This is outside. Um, I get I get several things dealing with money. Let me, let me just go through what we got here. Learning a new way to increase your financial wealth, okay? I see that someone might owe you or will be giving you a little financial wealth. Take these responses as you will, all right? Um, don't spend this new financial wealth too fast unless you really need to. Uh, some of you will use, will need this uh, for your upcoming rent as well as mortgage payments, okay? So uh, if you get a little bit today, well, it's pretty darn close to when you need to uh, spend. And I get that loss right there. I know you prefer to spend it elsewhere, but, you know, you need that roof over your head. And so does someone else buy you, all right? Okay, so uh, anyway, we got several things there dealing with finances. You know, you get a loss. If you don't spend it, you could get another loss. Duh. You know, but uh, someone could be giving you something today. And uh, you will also find out how you can make something else. You know, if you're seeing this video early enough in the day and you got some time to work on this, well, um, explore some options that will increase your wealth, all right? So. And then, uh, yeah, you know, you know, check into these things because it looks like this is a good thing for you to do. All right, um, you know, you're creative. You know, you have special talents that you don't use all the time. And uh, if you're looking for work, well, I think that uh, you know, this is just coming in. You know, and uh, if you're looking for work, that uh, uh, today is a good day. Believe it or not to uh, reach out to others. This could be your learning experience too. So, yeah, it, and it looks good, it's all positive, right? The only negative thing that you get in this reading is uh, the giving away of your newfound riches, huh? or riches, you know, you get your financial situation going down a little bit, but there are several ways that you could pick it up. So, since I'm in this position, ladies and gentlemen, please click that thumbs up you know, the hitchhiking sign there to uh, say that you like the video and I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, seeing the symbols. And uh, remember to please leave comments, share the videos where you can, and remember to please subscribe. You know, click that little circle down there, that moon. You, know, you, you see that picture of the moon? I took that myself. So, uh, yeah. So you got that picture of the moon with my name on it, that little red box that says subscribe on it. Just click there, it'll take you to our homepage and our homepage channel. And uh, you just click subscribe and become one of our mystics. Mystics, people who can see things that are not visible to their own eyes. So, yeah. Uh, what else, everybody have a good, safe New Year's if you're gonna be doing something. Uh, I'd say give me a call if you're too tipsy, but uh, that's not going to work. So, no drinking and driving. We want you back here Monday morning for the morning rush. And don't let others drink and drive. If you see them, take their keys away. Listen, a little call to the right people to prevent someone from going on the road when they're not in the right frame of mind. Uh, well, they might not uh, see it as a positive thing towards you, but in your heart, you know you did the right thing. So don't let them drink and drive either. Have a good night, and we shall be back here Monday morning with the Monday Morning Rush. All right, ladies and gentlemen, reading is done. Bye. Should I